Hey guys, here today just to show the autotyper I made for Discord. It works with basically any application that you can click on and type into, but I primarily made it just for Discord use. It's open source, all the stuff's on GitHub. Uh, when you download it and try to run it, it will come up with a smart screen protected your device or whatever. Um, that's because it's not whitelisted by the Windows smart screen yet, so you'd have to click uh, run anyway. It'd come up like this. It's just a very simple layout. I didn't try to overcomplicate it. It really doesn't need to be complicated at all. So I'll tell you when it's running. You can trigger a loop. So this will run uh, every five seconds. It will say hello every five seconds and it will repeat until you stop it. Uh, if you want to do it once, you can turn off loop. It will say hello after five seconds and it will stop. Delay between lines uh, in seconds. So say you want to say hello. And then two seconds later, you want it to type hi. It'll type hello, two seconds later, it'll type hi. And then if you have loop on, it'll wait five seconds to do it again. That kind of thing. And I'll demonstrate that now. So, yeah, this is the, the Discord. If you need any help or have any suggestions with this application, then hop into the Discord. Link will be below. Uh, you know. All right, so we'll start it. So it's typing in four, three. Make sure your focus is on Discord. You'll type hello, two seconds later, it should type hi. And because it's on loop, it's going down again. So if I stay on this, hi, uh, sorry, hello, and then hi. And then you can cancel it at any time. Um, if you don't want to delay, you just want to say hello, or hello, hi, every one second, you can do that too. Hello, hi, hello, hi. Uh, you're likely to be timed out if you do that though. Uh, you can cancel at any time. If you try to type, so if this hits zero and you've clicked on this, so this is in focus, it will come up with an error just so you don't go overriding what you have written down. Uh, you should always keep your like click on the application you want it to type into. It's as simple as that. It, if you have any suggestions or changes you would like me to add to it, hop into the Discord, let me know. It's free, open source, like I said. The link to the GitHub and the download from Mediafire will be below. And enjoy using it. Thanks for watching.